Spiders have hearts, which means if you've ever stepped on one, you literally broke its heart. You can actually see evidence of this heart when you take a look at a spider under the microscope like what we're doing now. At first glance, there doesn't seem to be a whole lot going on, but when we take a closer look with the right filter, which will increase our contrast a little bit, we're actually able to see inside of the spider's legs. And when we take a look at the legs, you'll see those little particles and fluid pumping through them. This is the spider equivalent of blood called hemolymph. And each time the heart beats, this fluid is pumped through the spider's legs and body. This substance helps to distribute nutrients in the spider's body in what we call an open circulatory system. This fluid also plays another role in our little spider friend here. It acts as a hydraulic system and helps the spider move and extend its legs. This is why if you've ever seen a spider no longer alive, its legs curl inward. If there's no pressure from a beating heart pumping fluid into the legs, they have nowhere to go but in.